red carpet. It's the UFC Hall of Fame weekend, UFC 276, and I'm here with a familiar face. A good friend of mine, Mr. Gilbert Burns. How are you, bro? I'm good, bro. Doing great. Man, we linked a couple of months back, but now we're here on the UFC red carpet. I gotta say, you're looking fresh, bro. Thank you're looking you. fresh. Thank you. You gotta look good for the Hall of Fame. And yeah. uh, what's gonna be your favorite part of the night? Giga Chikazi is a big thing, you know? DC double champ, I think that's my goal there. Be become a UFC champion. If freaking DC fat guy, you look at him, you don't, <laughs> you don't give nothing to the guy. You know, the guy kind of fat, chubby, freaking two times UFC champion. Mm -hmm. That got my respect like very, very much. Not just a fighter, but a chubby guy being an Olympics and freaking UFC champion, not UFC champion, two times, two division champion, double champ. That's a different level. Not a lot of guys are will be able to accomplish that. He did that. Last but not, not least, Khabib. 20 freaking 9 and no. Wow. I think I'm 20 wins right now, five losses. He's a lot of wins, 20 wins, but the guy got no losses. 29 wins, so that's a different level. So I'm looking forward to these guys' induction to the, to the Hall of Fame. Let's talk about you for a minute because there's obviously a fight of the year between that's getting inducted. That was between Cub Swanson and Duho Choi, Korean Superboy. I got a feeling that Gilbert Burns versus Hamza Chimaev might be in that wing one day. What do you think? It has good possibility, you know. I'm, uh, I kind of move over from this fight. I still, I, people are still talking about it by today everywhere. I go, people, man, your last fight. I'm the guy that, that always want to get a finishes on my fights. And whenever I saw those wars, they like, man, I don't want to be on those wars. I want to be a finisher. But it happened, you know, so I'm, uh, yeah, I hope it goes to the Hall of Fame one day. You got my vote, bro. Now, I do want to talk about the 170-pound division. It seems like there's a lot of guys on social media that are talking, hey, give me a fight. You got Nate Diaz begging for a fight. You got Dustin Poirier begging for a fight. Now you got, I don't know if you saw Shavkat Rachmanov yeah. over Neil Magny the other weekend. What do you think of these guys? Who's next for Gilbert? I can't fight any one of these guys. I never say no to a fight, and I'm pretending to finish my career. Never say no to a fight. Next fight's gonna be off, like we're talking about already for my next fight. The name is Jorge Masvidal, that's the fight that we're talking. Uh, he kind of agree. he kind of said my name multiple times. UFC like it, we're kind of talking about this fight already. I just renewed my contract with UFC, they just gave me a new contract. Yeah, looking forward to this Jorge Masvidal, but I would say yes for any one of these guys. Uh, Nate, Dusty, any one of these guys, I'll, I'll, I'm saying yes any day of the week. My man, Dorino, you're a fan favorite for a reason because you always, like you said, you take those short notice fights, you'll fight anybody, but Jorge Masvidal versus Gilbert Burns, I like the sounds of that, my bro. Hey, we're out here, full send MMA with the man, Gilbert Dorino Burns, UFC Hall of Fame, UFC 276. Appreciate you.